How did this happen? Who's to blame? Well, certainly there are those who are more responsible than others, and they will be held accountable. But again, truth be told, if you're looking for the guilty, you need only look into a mirror. Pay for what you did, shit, we ain't forget it We charged into the game, took the pain as credit No fame for the reckless, maintain neglected Too many lame professors with the same perspective I came protected, when you hear my name respected Aim for cheddar, but that ain't gon' make it better Sustain pressure like a million, change the weather My presence heavy as ever, best get it together Professional trendsetters, stay fresh to death as endeavors like Mecca Evers, kick lessons for my brethren Steady, I'll be ready with the message and the medicine My sentiment is genuine, the essence of a gentleman, vendetta specialist, listen to the seconds tick slow as you flow your last breath and then the weapon spit oppression is a bitch, won't let it get the best of us, two shot boondock millennium exodus. We have two political parties owned by the same set of corporate lobbyists. They are placed in their positions by the corporations with popularity artificially projected by their media. CNN, NBC, ABC, Fox, and all the others present all news pre-filtered to maintain the status quo. Can't call the shorty still recording at the border. Lonely man slaughter. What about poisonous in the damn water? Sean Hannity, the man who be the man to torture for. Profanity for sure. Show no sanity for cure. No clarity secure. Though as if it seems heart disease. Clogged arteries. Read between. Pre-filtered media needed to feed inferior. Believed it. Lead it. I'm bleeding up in hysteria. The reason for the Foul treating is to keep you eating more defeated by chemical warfare. Slowly depleted, my system is no fair, but I don't care. Status quo, nowhere. The baddest with a bold stare. It's automatic, grab a gap whenever ghost head. Probably a trap, though. I'm posted up in smoke air. Rush the news station yelling at the coast clear. Vendetta mask on face, so sincere. The economic hitman. Perhaps the most common is that we will identify a, a country that has resources our corporations covet, like oil, and then arrange a huge loan to that country from the World Bank or one of its sister organizations. But the money never actually goes to the country, instead it goes to our big corporations and corporations. Money, money, hitman, creeping through your country land, wiping out the resources, all thanks to Uncle Sam. A subtle plan, enough currency corrupts a man, that's why the World Bank and IMF got the upper hand. Ecuador, Bolivia, Rio de Janeiro, outsourcing corporations, slaving people like the Pharaoh, silence barrels, prefer to tape recorder with the C4, elite street force, reporting in the peace wars. I speak for the poor that struggle just to eat more, respect for the hustle, flex muscle to keep yours. Leaders rock for the people and get taken out, Hugo Chavez was ill when he made it out. Che Guevara was the same in his era who said the government itself was creating the terror. Profit off interest, inflating the capital, underestimate the day when there's a nation full of radicals. Expose the banking fraud. Citibank, J.P. Morgan Chase, and Bank of America are the most powerful controllers within the corrupt Federal Reserve System. It's time to boycott these institutions. If you have a bank account or a credit card with any of them, move your money to another bank. If you own their stock, sell it. If you work for them, quit. This gesture will express contempt for the true powers behind the private banking cartel known as the Federal Reserve. With four corporations owning all major media outlets, objective information is impossible.